Welcome back, Skeleton Crew, to another Radnorock Classic Cartoon Commentary. Today we're headed back to 1942, August 1st, 1942, to be precise. And what an opening. I mean, is, is there a more iconic opening in all of animation? We're hanging out with the Looney Tunes and uh, checking out what they had to offer for World War II propaganda cartoons. Which, you know I love. You know what else I love? Puns. <laughs> the Ducktators. The Ducktators. <laughs> uh, if this wasn't my 15th take, that would have been a lot more fun. <laughs> Some years ago, yeah. a seemingly unimportant event occurred. The narrator sounds like Criswell. The amazing Criswell. You know who that is? That chick should not be smoking a cigar. Nah, chicken. Uh, nah, it's okay. Mr. And Mrs. Uh -oh. Duck were expecting. <gasps> is that Mr. Duck? I assume so. And there's Mrs. Duck. You could tell by the bonnet. That's a black egg. Mama, this is Lord. What? Are they German too? A dark horse? Is that what he said? No, it's a duck. It's a da! Ah! Oh my god! Whoa! not so fast. They uh. All right, but time does fly. Came out, came out the gate hard. Oh, Johnny is the narrator. Oh, it was a bad egg. And with artistic aspirations, dreamed of brush and palette. But ended up <laughs> oh, gosh. Only the brush. They don't know art, and they read it. Uh, that is true to life. Burned, he soon turned to other endeavors. Hitler was a failed artist. You dopes. He's got more of a devil walk than uh, your your standard Hitler cut. No! And there were some gullible ones Always uncomfortable. Well, what just happened to that goose? Did you see that? Tweaked! One goose. One goose. <laughs> is, is this going to be a Mussolini goose? Yeah, it is. <laughs> yes, it is. Wow. <laughs> we wish to apologize to the nice ducks and geese who may be in the audience. <laughs> this is this is fun. Oh boy! Man, they're really, really uh, coming out hard with this one. Oh no. Sick. Get it? Sick, because he's sick. <laughs> really? Really losing the, the goose, the gooseness of of this this fella. Is he supposed to be Goosalini? Is it more puns with him? Is that the chick that was smoking a cigar? <laughs> If not, it should be Gusolini, if, if it isn't. <laughs> it really takes goose-stepping to a whole, a whole new level. Stormtroopers get it because they were in a storm. Man, everything about this is super punny. The Dove of Peace. All thoughts of peace from off this place. Have they forgot? Tis yes. Love that's right. Oh. And not is gained by show of might. Well, where were you at the beginning of all this? A peace conference. I was going to say they're really, really focused on Mussolini, but, you know, there we go. <laughs> they, they're really like from out of the West came another partner to make a silly axis of himself. Touching on reality in like such a loony way. But it, but, but everything is historically 
you know, accurate, if one could say that. No pulling punches on the stereotypes, though. Not at all. Even through through some unnecessary ones in there. <laughs> oh my gosh. Oh, it was such a different time back then, wasn't it? But at the same time, at the same time, it was wartime. So, what's what's the saying? All's fair in love and war. <laughs> oh gosh. Who's this gonna be? Oh, just nobody. I don't understand the olives. Olive branch, got it, got it, got it. The Dove of Peace is really... There we go, okay. I was going to say, really hesitant when it comes to getting involved, but I, I see why now. Yeah, there we go. Gonna hit him. <laughs> you know, if this was a Disney short, that dove would have like an American flag wrapped around his neck. A stinko. <laughs> you see that? The puns, the puns. Oh. Is that supposed to be bugs? That was interesting. There we go. There we go. I hate war, but once begun, <sighs> peace and quiet. So I can point with pride and say, there's three that didn't get away. <laughs> wow. If you would like to make this true, so this the victory had had not been accomplished yet. But you know what? If we all went out and bought some savings bonds, you know. The war's war's in the bag at that point. That's all, folks. That is just wow. Wow. Uh, heavy. Heavy handed on the stereotypes. But then again, again, it was wartime. So, I mean, this is. This was propaganda at its finest. And. Yeah. <laughs> Different from Disney's, but, but still, still a delight. So, thanks for being a friend. Telling a friend. See ya.